With the paint stripper left to work its magic, Dom can unpack the box of loose components that owner Janet brought along with the pole. I've just got endless bits and bobs in here. This is a little bit like a disappointing Christmas present. <laughs> It's always tricky when things arrive in pieces that someone else has taken apart, potentially lost nuts and bolts, bits missing. I can tell the red and white part that would spin inside the barber's pole would, be, would have been attached to these two discs. All of these parts I can deal with. Um, I don't think there's anything here that's going to be too difficult, but fixing this motor is beyond me. I don't want to start taking this apart. I think I'm going to take this inside the barn, maybe speak to Tim. If there's one man that can get things spinning again, it's Tim Weeks, the repair shop's gramophone guru. Tim, hey. Oh, Tom. Hey, what you got? This has come out of uh, Janir's barber's pole in a box of bits. What do you ah, think? It is a Garrard electric gramophone motor. Wow. I mean, presumably the company that made the rotating poles, they must have just bought motors in that were available right. on the market at the time, and this would have been one of them. Do you think yeah. you can get it running for me? Yeah. We'll get that apart. Can I leave it with you then? Leave it with me, I'll clean that up. Thank you. <laughs> Cheers. I've seen plenty of these. Gramophone motor. That bit is where the turntable would normally sit. It's even got the speed control mechanism here. <laughs> Never seen one used in quite this way before. But the most cogent point is it's absolutely covered in grot. Oh, look at the state of that. This should be nice and oily, and it's like fudge that's gumming it up good and proper. Hey, look at that. So all this lot's got to come out of here. Then we can actually get at it, and then the dog can see the rabbit. We've cleaned all the grot out of the motor, put it back together. Now the moment of truth. Does it work? Or will all the lights go out? Only one way we're going to find out. Oh, yes. And there she is, spinning round. Right, I think we're ready to take that back to Dom, see how he's getting on with the rest of the light. Hey, Dom, how's it going? How's it going? I'm anxious. It goes. Yes. It goes. Fantastic. We have it turning. Oh. We can adjust the speed. Thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, it's a pleasure. I shall leave it in your capable hands. With all the various components now repaired, painted and prepped, metalwork expert Dom is nearing the end of his renovation. The illuminated emblem that hung outside a London barber shop for three decades. Dom must now earn his stripes, decorating the spinning inner tube in the iconic red and white livery. I was really worried about doing that. I think it looks really, really good. I'm super pleased. I can't wait to get it installed now. The motor is affixed to the striped pole, and the whole mechanism can be slotted snugly inside the glass tube. <laughs> 